Welcome to Master Duel Maskus, the series created by Simo, where you take a literal pile of garbage that is five Master Packs and attempt to climb your way through rank. Every win gets you a Master Pack and a little bit of hope that your deck can be slightly less bad. I thought the idea looked fun, so I figured I'd give my own run a shot. Hopefully we can get some good cards and keep our win loss above 33%. aren't straight even if you are straight you're just level nine in what what does that mean like with that guy like he's making content for i don't know like do, does it matter if he's not actually gay if you're enjoying the content in the way that it's intended to be like i don't does it like does this real life actually matter it's not like you have any <laughs> oh and master Duel. nice so you started pretty recently r straight yeah <laughs> hold on Wait, why can't I battle? Oh, I got Threatening Road. I'm so dumb. Imagine being able to read. Could not be anyone that plays Yu-Gi-Oh. Started using Salamangrate. Salamangrate's pretty good. I've never used it myself, but I feel like it's a, it's a pretty good introduction to Link summons. If you're new to the game in general, I'm sure that'll be helpful. Or if you've just recently started playing Master Duel itself. Yeah, I... Honestly, the fact that it's so late... Kind of... Call me off guard as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna fire this now. Now that you have uh, nothing. I'm sorry, Garbage Lord? Why is this here? Is that like a bait? <laughs> Somebody calling a bomb squad for you? I got you where you were. And there goes everything. Um, should I keep summoning? No, we're just gonna... Uh, this is probably a bot, now that I'm... You created 15 decks? What does this do? Do I have to read this? Wait, did I have to read that? Oh, you can target one Zodiac in your graveyard, add it to your hand. Okay, I'm fine. Is the Salamangrate one your favorite so far? Or have you not tried out a whole lot of them? Currently, my deck is just a pile of garbage. <laughs> um, I'm doing a challenge where I can only use cards from the Master Pack that I pull starting with like nothing so I don't really have a theme to the deck yet <laughs> a 
I'll stop getting it up. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, Eduardo. Never apologizing for getting it up. Stream can always be more gay. Homie just gave me lethal, thank you. It's so nice. Rewarded. Could this be a usable UR? Uh, this is another for hire card. Okay. Flower Cardian. I do have a card for those, but... Hmm. This thing is good. I just don't have level 1s, probably. <laughs> you haven't been engaged, Grammy Moat? Your next project, we know. We know what it is. Empty Machine. Absolutely not. Burden of the Mighty. Is this playable in sealed this card this card was like the king of playground Yu-Gi-Oh when i was a kid my friend had this card and it was so annoying <laughs> it was so good wait yuna zombie okay hold on yuna zombie is actually good i have a really good zombie monster that i could that i can use with that i didn't get any legacy packs bro Okay, so I think this is still worth it. Take this out. I don't want this. I hate that card. Yo, we got Unizombie and Burden of the Mighty. Okay. Also, this dude is glued to our hands. What is this? That's a You're telling what? Like the shell, sure, everything. We have the same deluxe mate. Yeah, I like, um... Is this Shurig? Are we... Yeah, Shurig, right? My brain is, like, blanking. But yeah, he's cool. I like the box. I like all, like, the inanimate dueling mate things like the car is funny the soccer ball the boxing glove surely we can play around this right just attack mm. is this a negate and destroy or just negate negate and destroy okay Hmm. All right, we'll start with Burden of the Mighty. Surely they'll just negate this, right? Although they have a bounce. I don't know how much it matters. Wait, does this send for cost? There's no way, right? No, it sends for effect. Yeah, that'd be crazy. <laughs> okay, I... Should I just leave? Still having a negate and a bounce. I don't know.
No, don't bounce my card. Okay. I mean, this hand would have been better going first, kind of, but even then... Like, at the end of the day, all Unizombie does is get, like, a big guy onto the field if they destroy him. So it's like... Hmm... It's good for this deck, but it's not, like, actually good, you know? Oh my god, Cash Tira. What time is it for me? It's almost 1am. <laughs> it's pretty late for here. And I actually woke up at a normal time. I fell asleep super early last night. So I'm getting kind of tired, not gonna lie. Okay, hold on. This is great for us. Now I can kill their... I can kill that with no consequences, right? Surely. What happens if I just don't activate an effect? What then? Nine thirty nine here. Yeah, PST. I feel like I was built to to be in PST, but unfortunately, I am EST. Yeah, same here, Louis. Honestly, I feel like I was built for, like, Hawaii time. The way I'd be staying up until 6am sometimes. My sleep schedule is messed up. Die. <laughs> okay. W. Honestly, they switched to defense. I don't know what I what I can do. Currently nothing. Oh, but my trap card is so imposing. No, what am I gonna do without my trap? So good. Yo. FF? Disconnect? Internet win? Please? Rewarded for not running away? No, they're back. What the heck? Oh, you moved to South America? Honestly, that makes more sense why you didn't fully know what was happening time zone wise when we did that collab. The time zone shift was insanely good. <laughs> I went to visit my friend in Japan twice before, and both times I'm like, wow, I'm just like a normal person now. Like, I wake up at like 6 a.m., I fall asleep at like 10, 10 p.m. This is what it's like to, to have a normal sleep schedule. <laughs> and then I come back and it's just pain. It's even somehow even worse than it was before. Uh what, what does this end on? It would have been really nice if they just like didn't draw the prank kid. That would have been like so super cool. No, it doesn't have a level. Power Corrupt Burden of the Mighty. Uh, so I lose, right?
All right, I'm just gonna leave. We're not gonna. Why did I even sit through all that? I guess I was distracted enough while while it was happening. Oh, I picked this, didn't I? This was this was a choice that I made, and now I have to live with, huh? Okay. Well, it's not like my hand is any good anyway. Uh, we didn't get our Giga Chad zombie because when we activated his effect initially, they negated it. So we didn't get to send our guy into the graveyard. Sad. Uh, I think we lose. <laughs> Next. I preemptively change this, and then uh, we'll, we'll see what they summon. I don't actually know what these cards do, but I know that they summon a bunch of, like, 2,500-plus attack monsters that we just will not be able to out, so we can probably just leave. Yeah, we're just going to leave. Uh, not the easiest games tonight, but like I said earlier, everyone that was like at any point of plat is now currently gold, so we're getting all the harder opponents. This might as well be like plat one games. But surely we'll just get another bot, right? This looks like a bot. All custom fields and everything. Surely this is a bot. <laughs> Adventure token. My behated. Virtual world? I haven't seen virtual world in like two years, dude. <laughs> Does this deck still exist? Do people still play this? It used to, its whole plan used to revolve around getting a guy from the extra deck that basically read, like, you cannot play the game. <laughs> like, detach one material, your opponent cannot play the game. Uh, but then that guy got banned, so now, uh, now I don't really know what it does. Apparently it sets up one generic negate, and that's about it. Actually, I'll hold my tongue until I see what they actually do. No thanks, I'm okay. I'm good. I would like to get one more win, but I don't know if that's gonna happen tonight. <laughs> Maybe I can take another look at the cards that we have and see if I can cook anything better off stream. Trap tricks. Can we play the game against this? Not really. Uh, okay. What does this thing do? I have to target that. Sure. No! It has an effect, of course. Floodgated. Classic. Floodgate's so annoying, dude. So cringe. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Omar. <laughs> Unfortunately, our deck is bad. So we don't get to play.
Okay, we got Unizombie. Another know the Mighty might be good for going second. Unfortunately, I feel like the next best part of Unizombie is that it's a tuner, but we're not drawing any of our free special summons with it, so it's kind of... Hmm. Alright, do we think this is actually right for Fluffle, or is it... Uh... Fusion... Uh, like, branded Fusion Pile? You love beaches too, but you hate it when you're swimming and a piece of seaweed or something wrapped around you? Honestly... Mood. <laughs> Anything like touching my legs or feet in the water? The worst. Alright, please. Please. Okay. Unizombie effect. Oh, let's go. Send our boy. Is there a point in activating Burden of the Mighty? No, not yet. I don't know. Let's just see what they got. Ash Blossom. Super Poly. Super Poly's crazy. That's so cringe. Bro. You're so lame. You're so boring. Oh my god. Uh, I usually just wear like swim trunks, like board shorts, I guess. Uh, yeah, I also do not wear speedos. One of my friends that did swim swears by speedos, but also he doesn't wear them to like pub public beaches. So when we hang out in his hot tub, though. He's like, you gotta wear- I'm like, I don't want to. I don't feel like it. Love good speed up, but you can't catch me wearing one. <laughs> oh, you know what I just realized? By activating Pacifist, it means I can't summon my train signal. You see you swimming in school and they made you wear speedos? Interesting that you were also forced to wear them, yet you hate them and my friend likes them. I think it's just a him thing. <laughs> Although, I feel like it's mostly America that doesn't wear them, so maybe it's an us thing. I don't know. Who knows? Alright, thank you for destroying Pacifist for me. I feel like that's actually not a good card for me to have. Hmm. I don't think I'd die here, but there's no point. Man, I feel like that was actually not bad. <laughs> oh, we queued another game. How did that happen? Why am I here? Alright, if this one's like a hard loss again, then I think we're just gonna end it. <laughs> it's late, the games are hard. Okay, this could be doable. Oh, if only they summoned any monsters. Two monsters, to be specific. What is this? Okay, neither player can activate a monster in the hand. This is the first match of the night? Oh, okay. Wait. Oh, 
so I'm discouraged for no reason. Okay, yeah. I feel better about this, then. This has got to be one of the worst mates in the game. I know I said I like the inanimate object ones, but this is like, this is a card. Bonfire. It's like an actual card. It's not like just a random inanimate object, which makes the, the novelty less appealing to me, personally. Alright, we're summoning out the turtle. Torrential Tribute. Send a try. Oh, Paleo? Okay. This is fine. Oh, wait. I can't activate monster effects in the hand. This is an activate. It is an activated effect. That's so annoying. I have a response. Banish a card. Uh. Die. I will not be letting you keep a monster, actually. Unaffected by monster effects, no! Me when I forget the whole point of these stupid cards. That's fine, it didn't matter. The result is the same. <laughs> if summoned this way, this card is unaffected by, by monstrous effects. So true, bestie. My bad. Alright, summon your other guy. I don't care. Alright, can we beat Paleo? Oh, they didn't want to summon it. Paleozoic Mozzarella? Honestly, that's... I didn't even get that far. <laughs> Holding arms. Unfortunately, fake. <laughs> Although, technically, technically, I can set this and it won't die. I mean, their dudes are unaffected anyway. No, I should just. I should just pass. Another monster on the field isn't going to do anything for me anyway. I'll save it for one of their three extra deck monsters. Or maybe they have like an actual monster in the deck. I don't know. We'll see. More traps. Yay! Come on, man. Never played this, but I'm manifesting a win. Thank you. I will also... I'll join you in trying to manifest a win. Um... 
basically, you can summon one monster with four stars or less per turn. Or you can, like, if a card tells you that you can summon them a different way, you can. But the end goal is to get your opponent's life points to zero by either attacking them directly or hitting over their monsters. This is crazy. I didn't realize I had so many bad monsters in this deck. Okay. There's a chance I can make Link 6. Wait, what are they transaction rollbacking? Destroy all cards? Oh. That's crazy. Who does that? Alright, immediately after calling Falco bad, he, his effect came into play. <laughs> so... I'll take it. like the subtle facial hair? Thanks. Honestly, normally I shave it, but I'm was lazy this weekend. <laughs> It'll probably be gone tomorrow. Enjoy it while it lasts. It's called I didn't want to shave today. <laughs> so true. I don't I guess I'm just setting monsters. Because apparently I have nothing with any attack points in this deck. I get lost when if you're gonna summon okay, they are gonna summon back. So now they've summoned their back guy back. My effect that I was never going to use is negated. My attack that I was never going to use is halved. I'll take it. What is that? <laughs> Getting rid of the bad cards so that we'll get full chain of OP cards? Yeah, yeah. Surely I have OP cards in the deck. Surely. Back check. This is literally just a bunch of... I don't want to say, like, bad traps, but, like, traps that don't read win the game. Because <laughs> there are traps that essentially do that for you. So... Hmm. I wonder what their plan is. Like, they're getting all these guys, but what are they going to do with them? They only have three cards in their extra deck. Extra deck being a way that you can... I'm sorry, what? Not activate cards or effects during the battle phase. Okay, so like when I negate that effect, does it just go down to zero or? Like, is this, it's a zero, zero, yeah. So like when I, when I normal summon holding arms, do you just lose the game? Like now what? Like, I'm so sorry. Oh, yeah, I can attack, okay. Normal trap, you can set it. Does it say you can activate it this turn? I really hope they activate it. 
Oh, tragic. That set card can be activated this turn. Darn. I really, <laughs> I was really hoping that they would activate it because if you've already declared an attack with threatening, when threatening roar is activated, uh, your attack still goes through. Because it reads like your opponent cannot declare an attack this turn, so normally it's like skip your battle phase essentially. But if they activate it in response to you already attacking, then it doesn't work <laughs> for that battle. All right, they've two, used two Dino Mishes and the Knight on a high note. Yes, please. <laughs> Which means, hopefully, my Unizombie won't get eaten. Won't get banished. That's what I was trying to think of. But I just actively chose not to say. Okay, so... I mean, I want to do this no matter what. We'll see if I have a little eight. <laughs> you think your favorite part of being girl would be not having to shave? I mean, yeah, girls definitely have to shave. They probably have, I imagine they have to shave their faces less. Not that they don't have to. But like, the amount of shaving that a girl does is significantly more than what a guy does. <laughs> Usually. Not that, like, obviously they don't have to, but most girls do. You know. Are they just like me for real? No, actually, no, this is good. Wait, this is this is amazing for us. All right, are you ready to see the combo? Combo? All it takes is our opponent not reading. So we protect him. We banish him, and then we summon him. He's amazing! Uh... Yeah, why not? No, my Unizombie! <laughs> That's okay, we have a real monster now. A little late there, Mikanko. A little late. Uh, okay, they just lose. Please just lose. Let's go. Okay. And now, last Master Pack of the night. Hopefully we're rewarded for playing in <laughs> Elo Hell. Realm of Light, I don't think this is real. Dragoonity Horse, also not real for us. Uh... Hmm... This, this is almost usable. I might look at that. A Gagaga? -ga -ga. We don't have those. Utopia? I don't have that. You can send one equipped spell you control that is equipped to this target to the graveyard. Target one monster your opponent controls, destroy that. Uh, probably unusable. Raw's Disciple, actually unusable. Solemn Warning! That's a good card. You have Utopia? Things have to save much 
Not more. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I have to save just as much as girls, if not more. Fair enough. Ah, bio. I see. Uh, this is probably fake. This is actually definitely fake. That's even worse. Okay. Uh, I mean, Solemn Warning is like an actual legitimately good card. So I'm happy with that. Okay, we got full going second combo. Pipe. Unless they do literally nothing, in which case. Oh, lab? We probably just lose to lab, right? They do double stovey. They can activate whatever this is. Lab search, lady lab. Wait, why did they activate two clock if they're not going to activate their trap card? Uh, I mean, when they summon Lady Lab, don't I just lose? Wait, why? I don't know if any of this is correct, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> they really can just throw stuff on the field, yeah. I have to attack that? Uh, then no, I guess. So if I equip this, then I can't die. What did they set? Fair welcome. Destroy the targeted card. I just think I lose, to be honest. I don't think it matters what I do. I can't. I can't. I can't. <laughs> like, even if there's any world in which I win, I don't want to spend three years watching them do nothing. The amount of triggers that that deck gets is insane. It's like every single thing that they do causes them to activate another card that either engrave or in hand.
They have Nightmare Pain. Uh... Yeah, I mean... Honestly, maybe I should have waited just a little bit longer, because maybe they would, uh... Orbit or something. Okay. <clears throat> uh, we're just gonna go for damage. And now... Hello? He set. Okay. Can he... Can you not? Uh, I just have to go battle. I don't have any monsters with attack. So, like, is this a bot, or is their deck just this bad? Darn. I guess it won't happen. Even now. Alright, well, we'll take the win. Um, but they're also, like, the only cards in my deck that are usable, essentially. <laughs> that have, like, longevity in their use. Uh, I don't have Blake Spreader. Banish four heroes? I do not have that. Is it equip? Equip only two normal summons that monster you control? Okay. Wait, this is so good. Wait, this is so good for us. What the heck? Only to a normal summon set monster you control. Uh, if I control an insect, I don't really have a lot of insects, I don't think. A uh, special summonable black wing. Booster strikes. Isn't this real? Uh, no. Not for us, at least. Hmm. Pitch is fine, but maybe not particularly useful for us. And Earth's Arctic, which is bad, even if I had the whole deck. Apparently I have four Legacy Packs. I think one of them is from a reward, but I'm just gonna take it. Oh no, I can't use this pack. This one is also pretty useless, I would assume. But probably bad. Yeah, there's like some good stuff in these packs, but all of these are bad. <laughs> am I am, am I getting burned? Is this a burn deck to me? I mean, bot behavior here, but I guess we'll see. I don't know. Alright, show me the third one. No? Okay. They didn't set anything either, which is good.
now we set I mean, this is seeming like a bot. We're just praying that we don't get burned to death by anything, I guess. We're setting two now. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> no open voice chat, so you can't annoy him. Tragic. We're up against what would seem to be another bot, but this one actually has win conditions, so... I'm just hoping that I don't get burned to death. <laughs> Is that for me or them? That was for them, right? Heads? Wait. I thought it was the other way around. <laughs> Sad. There's no way I lose to this stupid AI burn deck. <laughs> I mean, they're still on the same level of a clock as they were last time. Yeah, it's because they had <laughs> three of this card that say deal a thousand damage. And then this card that could have maybe gained 2,000, but I flipped the tails, apparently. So I don't think that should be anything that can kill me yet. What is that? Is this worth it? I might die for this. Okay. Depending on what their face down is, I could lose. <laughs> What are they, like, how? Okay. Like, what could possibly be taking them this long? Please be nothing. Please. I'm begging you. Un 
unfortunate. Well, I lose. Man, I guess if I could have gotten another thousand attack on board, but I don't think I could have. That's so cringe. That's so annoying. If if either I flipped the heads or they flipped the tails, then we won. But Alright, let's see if we can gather any idea of what they're playing. Blue eyes. Can't help but feel like... None of these things that I have will help me against Blue Eyes. These cards are more for like stopping good decks. Although I guess we can probably kill Alternative with Blackhorn. Yeah, I knew it was going to be that. Guess I'll activate this, why not? Special summon the blue eyes from hand? I don't care. Train time. Okay. Level 5 Synchro. I have this. Not high enough. I have this. Not high enough. I have this. Not high enough. No answer yet. Can we draw a Mikanko card? And that'll be good. Destroy all monsters. Oh, okay. Well, at the very least, I won't take damage. <laughs> Potentially. Oh, wait. Blue Eyes can't attack this turn. This is like... Elementary school Blue Eyes deck, huh? Why did I put this here? Why why did I do that? What is wrong with me? Alright, whatever. It's fine. Uh this card has an effect where whenever it's sent to the graveyard by a card effect, then it can special summon itself. So the first time I discarded it for effect, and then the next time they destroyed it with this card effect. Uh but if they attack it, then it will stay in the graveyard. This card, I just have two of. <laughs> I don't know why he keeps coming back. <laughs> you should play a second monster, Smiley. Hmm.
It shows Nazis as fucked. Interesting. Okay. So this guy gets 500. I can make him get... I can make him get a thousand. I could get him just big enough to kill blue eyes. Uh, we're using everything that we own to do it, though. Wait. It destroys all spells and traps. Oh. You know? Now I know. One day, I'll learn how to read. Does Ro have to be an attack? <laughs> no, okay. Interesting. Alright. Well, that could have gone better. But... Now I know. Now I know what Burning Dragon does. <laughs> I don't think there's like any world in which that was the correct choice, to be honest, but... That's crazy, they should have saved that. That's crazy, my only dragon in the whole deck. Ah! Uh, I'm losing it. I hate this. I hate everything about this. Okay. Outdrawn. Now we just need to draw another machine. so much easier if I just drew one of my Mikankos with that equipped spell. 